morning. My name is Katherine Thomas. I have been um, diagnosed with macular degeneration. With this disease, I have lost vision in my right eye and now gradually my left eye is becoming affected. Time and time again, I messed up that microwave by pushing the wrong buttons and I knew that many days I wore socks that didn't match. But worst of all, with my condition, I was losing the ability to read. I couldn't even read the newspaper. My family has been very supportive. After much research, they purchased an iPad for me. This iPad had certain features that would allow me to use it more effectively. But then, as time went on, I really began to think about this. Here I am, 90 years old. I have a condition that has no cure. I knew what would happen. So finally, I gave in. After the appointment was made, the occupational therapist came to my home. And after some small talk, she sat beside of me and said, Catherine, what can I do for you? How can I help you? There and then, I knew she was for real. She really wanted to help me. Didn't take me long to tell her my story. And after listening to what she had for me, I readily accepted the solutions I have a talking clock, and I even have buttons on my microwave. As a result of her visit, I received reading glasses. Now, the lenses in my left eye was highly magnified, and by putting reading material just so, I could see words. This opened a new world for me. It gave me back my life. Now, when I come to church, I use the large print bulletin because with my glasses, I can read along with you during the service and I can even sing. You know, God has blessed me in so many ways. He has given me many hands to lead me along the way. I remember a poem that I recited one Sunday during Children's Day. It said, My life is like a pansy face. It makes the world a better place. And I'm going to do my bit because Jesus has a need for it. I often think of that poem. Even with my low vision, I know that I can still do it. Thanks be to God.